Oh my god, where did all my turrets go? Where did all my turrets go? What's up, Space Cadets? This is KJ48, and welcome back to my Let's Play for Imperion Galactic Survival. Last episode, I was lamenting the fact that I wasn't level 10 because I want to make a very special item today. Um, I did grind, ground, grinded, I don't know, whatever you want to call it. Um, I got to level 10 after last video, and we are going to be making our first hover vessel that's also going to be a drill ship, okay? Now, I've got a couple, uh, I've got a couple drill ships in mind, but I think I'm going to go with this one right here, the Spange Miner. I made it last season. Um, it has its issues with balance, but I know it, I know it'll work with the weight system. Um, the other one I was looking at was the Ladybug, and the Ladybug was made a long time ago, way before the weight system was in the game, and I don't know if it's been updated, so I'm going to go with the Spange Miner, because I know it worked last season, and um, I know it's going to work this season. If you guys have any auto miners, uh, or not auto miners, God, I wish auto miners. If you guys have any hover vessel miners that you guys know work with Alpha 10, uh, with the weight system and everything, all that stuff put together, um, just let me know in the comments. But I'm going to go with the Spange Miner just because I know, um, I know I'm going to like it. Oh boy, what the hell's going on up here? Oh man, I even noticed that. Had a freaking uh, radiation fog coming in, huh? While I was mining. Oh boy. Anyway, what I, the cool thing about this game, though, is if I, like, let's say I make the Spange Miner, and then you guys give me another Miner that's better. What I can do is I could just take apart the Spange Miner and put everything into the new Miner. And the cool thing about it is you don't even lose any, as far as I know, unless they've changed it last time I did it, they didn't, it wasn't like that. But, you know, what happens is when you take apart uh, one of your ships, this thing's out of... Okay. When you take apart one of your ships, you get 100% of the resources back. Again, unless it's changed, which could be the case, but I don't think it is. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the copper in there, and we are going to turn this sucker into copper bars. Um, where are the copper bars? Copper? Copper's right there. Is that cozy? There's like a lot of... Uh, oh, we got to scroll up. There we go. There's the copper bars. And then what we're going to do is we're going to come in here, and we are going to grab the silicon, and we're going to grab the carbon substrate stuff and we're going to put those right into there we still need some more of that but that's easy enough um silicon is, oh we still need some more silicon so we're going to need some more silicon and some more carbon substrate the carbon substrate like i said um you just make that no problem uh let's just go in here and we'll just make some more let's go ahead and make another 10 10 worth so while that's doing its thing i want to go out and i want to um am i actually going to get poisoned out here yeah, that's more than my suit can handle. My suit can only handle four. So we have to actually wait for that radi radiation fog to be gone. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick some of these plants. And I'm going to put everything in here. Um, one of the other things I want to do today, if we can get to it, and I'm going to try really hard to, is I want to make more solar panels. Because um, I think solar panels are going to be incredibly important because this base is having real, real fuel issues. Like, serious, serious fuel issues. Um, as a matter of fact, I'm going to come out here and we are going to grab some of the fuel out of here. Another thing I can make is a shower. Shower will actually uh, get rid of my radiation poisoning, which is pretty cool. There we go. And uh, But I'm not getting it. I'm not getting the radiation poisoning because I'm getting out of there quick enough. At least I think that's what the bottom number means. Um, big number is the local temperature or radiation. Um, small bottom is the outside and the small top is your body. So I think if I stay out in the radiation for too long, the top number where it's, where it's radiation there will start going up and then that's like permanent radiation and you have to take a shower to get rid of it. So I'm just out here digging up some more, uh, silicon because to be perfectly honest, I don't feel like waiting. And if worse comes to worse, I believe I can actually make a shower. Um, it's weird though. I'm getting 5.5 radiation and I'm pretty sure my suit can't handle can't handle that much but i'm still not getting any like radiation damage on my guy unless i'm reading these things wrong which i very well might be but i think that top little number is the thing that like signifies the radiation damage on my character all right guys the spange miner is on its way we have about six minutes left and while i'm waiting while i'm waiting i don't know why i waited for this but i've been level seven for a while i'm gonna go ahead and make the real drill why not and then i'm gonna make some drill charges for it because that's what I want to do. Um, how many of these uh, multi-charges do I have? Eh, I'm probably going to need some of those as well. Um, let's see if there's anything else we can do here. Uh, yeah, we probably need some more ammo. Some more projectile ammo. And maybe some more 15 mil. It should be pretty good. All right. 
Um, we also need some more blocks, but that's what we need to mine for. I gotta get, I gotta really get mining, man. Um, this will probably be the last non-combat video we're gonna do. I'm probably gonna go out and like, you know, smoke some fools next episode. Uh, now what was my, what was my, um, yeah, bandages were my healing thing of choice. Um, open wounds, broken leg, closed fracture, and open fracture. But there's other things. There's detrimental burn, I think I always get. Is that what it's called? Detrimental burn? I don't know. Let's see. Let's see if we have um, any kind of healing thing that can take care of that. Um, so yeah, there we go. So that's herbal leaves and plant protein. Um, that takes care of radiation. That takes care of uh, poison. Oh, poisonous bites a good one. So we need herbal leaves. Alien tooths are going to be a pain in the ass because I think we can only get those from killing you know aliens. Those herbal leaves are going to be important. Let me see if I have any herbal leaves. What the freaking hell is that? Freaking thing just attacked me. Punk ass. I think it's actually called Freaky. I don't know if it did any damage, but man. Yeah, creepy. <laughs> Not freaky, creepy. Oh, alien tooth. So that's good. I'm out here looking for herbal leaves. Um, probably not the best thing to be out here in the middle of the night, alien planet and all, but I need some herbal leaves. I guess I could always look it up. Problem is, um, the game's been updated so much and, like, things change so much that just because, you know, you think you get herbal leaves one, you know, one spot, it just, it changes from update to update. So I have a real hard time, uh, finding herbal leaves. You guys know where there are any. Um, feel free to let me know in the comments, please. Oh, there you go. Beautiful. Let's get back. Turn some of these. Uh, hopefully, I can. Hopefully, I can make um, you know, uh, saplings out of this so I can plant them. That would be wonderful. Might be wondering why I didn't take my uh, hover vessel out here. I don't freaking know. I don't freaking know. I just, I just ran out here. I'm like, I'm gonna get some herbal leaves. Let's do it. You know. And now I'm freaking, you know, just hobbling back with no stamina whatsoever. Um, oh, by the way, one of my friends told me that y they can attack through walls. Uh, when, when you get attacked from the enemy, um, let me take a look really quick what my chances are. Yeah, 20%. If they attack, they can hack your core from like 30 blocks away through walls. Let me know if that's the case or not, please, because that's beyond stupid. I mean, the word stupid doesn't cover how idiotic that is. Um, so if it is true, I hope it gets changed and changed fast, man. Like, that's just awful just awful all right so let's throw all that stuff in there um all right so let's see what we got here uh we're gonna go to here there we go and we're gonna go to here and uh, um that's coffee we need herbal 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 if I, right here um vegetables herbal leaves there we go I don't know how many of those I can make, but I want to make as many as possible. And then we're going to plant those. We're actually going to have to pick something up to plant it, though. All right, guys, it's time to expand the farm a little bit. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick that stuff up. We're going to pick this up. And then we're going to place that right down, just like that. There we go. And now every spot in here should be covered by grow lights. And I went ahead and made some more plots. So let's take a look right here. I made them out of wood because that's all I had. Um, I mean, I, I, I didn't have the stone to make the concrete. I could have went and got some, but I'm like, eh, wood is fine. There we go. All right, so now we're going to go ahead and replant the stuff we picked up because one is a natural stimulant, which I could use for coffee at some point, I guess, and the other one's vegetables. So we're going to do that, and we're going to do this. And then what I'm going to do is basically this whole thing is about prepping. The reason I, the reason I planted these herbal things is because we're prepping for combat next video. So let me go through and make sure I have everything planted, everything set up um, to make healing items for next video. All right, it's morning, and um, let me just take a look at what's going on at the base. Yeah, man, the power. Oh, the power is not good. All right, let's just throw a bunch of stuff in here just to get it out of my inventory. There we go. I don't know why I have another plant grow light, but whatever. Get out of my inventory. All right, so what? this is what I'm looking at, guys. First of all, um, it's really annoying, like, how many healing items do the same things. And there's there's way too many healing items in this game. Um, unless I'm just misunderstanding them. Like, you know, uh, the, the two I'm looking at right now are antibiotic ointment, which will help against dermal burn. Um, frostbite I haven't had a problem with. Open wounds is taken care of by the bandages. So basically, um, this is only used for dermal burn. And then I'm looking at anti-toxic ointment, which will handle poisonous bite. And dermal parasites. And there's some other stuff in here, but I'm not going to worry about it. Also, I made some energy pills. 
So that's cool. Stamina boost uh, during 300 seconds, which sounds really awesome. And that stuff's being made. So I think we're going to be good to go for next episode. We'll hit up some POIs. We'll do the quests. We'll see where things go. But for now, let's come on out here and let's um, let's grab some fuel. We're also going to have to hit the... Uh, we're going to have to hit that Promethean deposit, man. Because um, the this, uh, this freaking biofuel just ain't going to cut it. All right. So let's go ahead and put this bad boy down. And let's take a look. All right, so um, devices, it's got, um, here, let's just do auto group just in case something's not grouped. And then we're going to look at harvest and container. And the container holds 5,700. All right, it's not bad. That's not bad for ore. That's not bad for ore. Also, I think, doesn't he have this thing set up so you could, like, switch things or something? I think he's got this set up for... Um, I thought he had th this stuff set up. That might have been another one, like, for different, like, settings. But that might have been a different ship. So, or a different person making this ship, for all I know. All right, let's just go ahead and put all this stuff in. Let's go do some drilling. So, what are we going to need first? Let's just go get some iron, man. Let's just go get some iron. Let's go get some iron, man. All right. And this thing does have guns on it as well. Um, could even have a... No, it doesn't have a turret anywhere. Pretty sure. Um, I've used so many, like, ships that I, I'm confused on which ones do what sometimes. All right, so let's do this. And these things are wonderful. I love these things. Now we're going to get some drilling done, people. Now, I know it looks bad, but you know what? It doesn't matter. Just drill everything until there's no more iron left. That's all you got to do. We're going to go in first person. You should definitely be doing this in first person as well. I'm also in the next... Uh, we're going to drill out all three of these... Um, all three of these ore deposits. And when I, But when I go to the next one, I'm going to drill some out by hand. Because I'm kind of curious on how, well, how good the hand drill is. Because um, the hand drill is... You know, the, um, I don't know, it's not called a hand drill, it's just called a drill, but it's kind of like a laser drill, um, and it's supposed to be a good one, and I, I haven't used it since the update, they said that they, they sped up all the drilling, so, you know. Um, this is also going to help me dig out underneath my base, although I don't know how I would get it back out of my base once I've dug underneath my base, but, you know, it's fine. Alright, I think that ore is completely done, you can see it's now off the map, I don't see any more iron. Now comes the fun part, we got to try and get this thing out of here. So let's try and get this thing out of here. Man, that wasn't so bad. That wasn't so bad at all. Damn. All right, man, let's go hit that copper deposit. I also want to clean out that spider nest. I could probably do the spider nest today. You know what? Maybe we'll do the spider nest today. That might be a, that might be a fun thing. All right, let's take this out. All right, copper. Time for you to get out of here. We should probably look at what our weight looks like. Oh, yeah, that's, we want to check in here. Hold on. O and Y and F. And V. There we go. Alright, let's see how this thing works now. Oh wow, that is really fast. Wow. This might make drill ships pointless. Wow, this might make the drill ships pointless. I mean, this is fast, dude. That is fast. Woo-wee! Yeah. I mean, I'm still glad I made the drill ship because I could use it to drill to the side of the mountain when I'm going to, like, make my base. Or underneath the base I'm in now. But, damn, that was quick. Holy crap. Oh, you know, another another good thing about the drill ship um, is that you uh, will over you get yourself overweight um, if you just drill by yourself. Because you can't hold as much as a drill ship, usually. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press F4. And we're on our own thing now. We're going to go to Spanj Miner. We will go to the ore. There we go. See? Look at this. Well, only 162. That's not really overweight. There wasn't a lot of copper left in there. But you get what I'm saying, though. Like, you, you get overweight a lot quicker. Like, basically, if I had all this stuff on me, I wouldn't be able to carry it all. Because it's 812 weight of uh, the 600 that I can carry. God, this thing is sweet. Holy freaking crap, man. This is wonderful, man. This game just got a million times better. Because this is, this is great. Oh, this thing is so fast. I love it. Beautiful. And now all three ore deposits in my area are complete. Totally complete. And I was throwing stuff in there. Let's put some more in there. That's what we're going back with. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That's wonderful. Now I want to figure out a way to have this thing dig underneath my base. Or should I even bother digging underneath my base? Because I, I don't want that to be my permanent base. But I'm going to be there still a good amount of time. Um, I think I'm going to stream. I'm, I keep saying I'm going to stream this on Fridays. Uh, uh, you know what? My um, I run servers for people who uh, subs who uh, subscribe to me on Twitch and people who support on Patreon. I run servers for those people, and they're asking for Imperion. So I'm pretty sure I'm going to be doing multiplayer Imperion starting Fridays. 
Um, so, I don't know if I could do that two days in a row. I gotta find out. I really want to stream this game. But um, that's going to be a little bit troublesome. Although I could probably play on here and then go to the multiplayer server. I want to do some farming on this place. I, mean, I want to find a place to live. I think up here in the mountain ranges, I think that's that's where I want to live. Maybe I'll check there today. All right, guys, we've got about 5% power left. Um, so I went ahead and made some more solar panels. So let's get these things up. Let's see if we can get these solar panels set up. I don't really have a great spot for them. Um, but I kind of need to get them set up like now. Um, well, actually, i got a decent amount of room up here, honestly. I don't even think I had this much room. Am I locked in? No, we got it right there. So I guess I can, I guess I can handle these. So that's nice. Um, I don't really know the best angle to put them on, so I guess I'll just put them on the opposite angle of this one, because um, eh, it'll be fine. Uh, actually, hold on. Maybe we could just get one of these. Yeah, there we go. That'll work. All right. So let's go ahead and do this like this. Come on. Come on. Work with me. That's not working with me. What's the matter with it? There must be there must be something in the way I'm not seeing. Alright, let's go ahead and take some stuff out. First of all, I'll take this out. We don't really need that. Take that out. That. There we go. Take that out. Oh boy. Okay. That'll be okay for now. Um, alright, so we should be able to put it in there, right? I don't know. It looked like it should like stuff should not have been in the way. Oh, there we go. Alright, that'll work. Probably not ideal, but that's alright. I'm not going to put it... Well, I should probably put it on an angle so it, it matches that one, I guess. Oh, there's nothing below it, though. Can't have that. And I should be able to get this back full. Yep, there we go. Uh, did it go in my inventory? I got it back. Where'd it go? Where did it go? There it is. Okay. So we'll do one. And slope. Uh, slope. Slope, slope. Okay, so some of them have, like, supports and some of them don't. So I want to get the one with the supports. There we go. Come on. There we go. All right, very good. Now let's get out of the way. These are yellow. Uh, oh, that's green. That's odd. I wonder why one's yellow and one's green. I don't remember what that... I don't remember what that stuff stands for. Um, but these, you know, they're not ideally set up, but it's okay. It's good enough for now. Um, you know, we'll do what we can, but... You just got to get these things up. All right, so let's go ahead and do that and turn it like that. Not exactly the most beautiful thing in the world, but we should have some more power coming in now, which is nice, which is what I wanted. So, oh my God, where did all my turrets go? Where did all my turrets go? There they are. Boom. Hells yeah. So I actually turned them all off to save power and it saves a pretty decent amount of power. Um, check out the power. It's 2% right now. Um, current output, uh, is right there, and you turn these off, and look at the consumption, consumption, it goes from 163 to, uh, 118, it's beautiful, and, um, my batteries are actually filling up, now, I, I always thought the, um, the output was what you were using, I don't believe that's the case, I think the output is the input, you know what I mean, like, the sun is coming into the solar panels and being input into my, into my storage, my batteries, but that's not the way this talks about. This talks about the output that the solar panels are putting out, which really kind of confused me. But I got it now, so that's wonderful. So we got some uh, we got some power issues. We just have to remember if we get attacked or if we leave to go do something. The reason I leave those turrets on all the time is because if I go leave to do something, I need them to be able to defend in case a base attack when I'm not around. And I have to remember, try to remember um, to do that. But. Whew. I mean, you guys know how my memory is. We'll see about that. All right. So, it's, uh, all that stuff went in. Did it go in the miner? Yes, it did. We're, we're hooked up to the miner. Uh, so, what we're going to do is we're going to go to headquarters. We're going to go to my pallet and put that all right there. And then we are going to un like link ourselves from the miner. So, I think we, I'm not sure how to do this the easiest way, but this is the way. It, oh, that's not the way to do it. This is the way to do it. Boom. Now his stuff won't go into the miner anymore. All right, you know what? Why don't we go hit that? Why don't we go hit that nest, man? Like for real. Um, I think I'm gonna make myself some anti-burn and poison stuff, and then we're gonna go hit that nest because why the heck not? One of these, one of these. All right, let's go hit it, guys. Get get, get us some spiders. Gonna go get us some spiders. Okay, we'll take this thing. This thing seems to be the most combat um, ready 
vessel we have, and I think it even has ammo in it. Yep, not a lot, but some. I mean, I'm probably gonna fight him, like, mostly on my, um, on, on foot with my own gun, but we'll see. We shall see. This spider nest has plagued me for too long. Well, not really. It hasn't even messed with me, but I keep seeing the red in the distance, and that bothers me. It, it gives me sleepless nights, and I don't need that. So what is the nest? Is it actually a physical thing I could just shoot? Yeah, it is. Let's see if we can get over there and shoot it. Yep. Maybe you can't destroy it. Oh, no, it's taking damage. There we go. It's not taking a lot of damage, though. It's taking forever. Um, you know, we might be taking some serious damage here. I don't know. I don't even know what spiders can really do to you. To your ship, you know? Get out of here, you little buggers. Bugger off. And do predator alien. Do everything. Kill everything. Alright, let's try this again. Oh, there it goes. It's getting some spiders now. It reloaded. Holy crap, this is taking forever. So, of course, as soon as I get that... Those extra solar panels up, my base is, uh, you know, starving of power because it decided to rain. Which kind of sucks, but what are you going to do? I went back to base and I made some, I made some explosives. So, let's see if we can uh, finish off this spider nest. It's going to kind of look around... I thought it would have been spawning more spiders, but I don't know. Let's see. Let's see what happens here. Come on. Blow it up. There we go. We should use those in the first place. It's probably what they're made for. Gotta take these freaking spiders out of here. Show them who's boss. Show them who runs this planet, right? I'm, su I'm really surprised it didn't spawn more spiders, to be honest. Oh man, it's not destroying those. What the hell? I'm not really sure why it destroyed the first one and not these. It's kind of weird. We only have five more, so... Oh, God, you're killing me. Come on, game. What are you doing to me? Come back here with some more 15 mil. Might have to do this next video. Huh? Ugh. Okay. Let's see what we got going on here. I'll probably shotgun him down a little bit. Wow. Okay. Well, I don't really know what's going on at this point. Let's just try and shotgun this piece of crap. Nope. Can't, see, you can't hurt it with these weapons. All right. Well, I guess I'll just make more 15 mil for the uh, hover vessel and take them out that way. But that's that's weird. It's weird that it destroyed the first one, but not the others. Anyway, guys, if you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time, and until then, take it easy.